Hello guys and welcome back to this video. In this video we're going to be making a jump scare, uh, like not like inappropriate or something. So uh, let's already start off. You need to make a uh, part. And I, I just made this little hallway. You can just randomly put the part somewhere. I'm going to put it like right over here. I'm going to scale it. I'm going to like put it like that and like that. And I'm going to make it transparency one anchored and can collide false. So that's already gonna be it. Let's name it jump scare part. Um, after you've done that, uh, you need to insert a sound like this sound, and you need to copy my ID one four 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 three 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 two three. So what this is gonna do? This is a scream sound effect. So um, you're actually gonna get a jump scare. Okay. So after you did that. Uh, you need to insert in replicated storage a remote event and call it jump scare event. Insert a script in your part and type script.parent.touch colon connect function of hit. Uh, if hit the parent colon find first child humanoid, then we're gonna go and get into game replicated storage dot jump scare effect dot uh, colon fire client not all clients but client um game the players uh, get player from character hit the parent a uh, fire client only um shows it for your play for one player but if you do fire all clients it's gonna show for the whole game so everybody gets scared because they get a jump scare from for no reason so let's just do fire all clients uh what we're now gonna do is you need to insert an image label um, scale it by 1.5 comma 0 comma 1.5 like this 1.5 comma 0 comma 1.5 comma 0 anchor point 0 0.5 comma 0 0.5 and position 0 0.5 comma 0 comma 0 comma 0 you know what I do all this you need now you want to insert a screen GUI uh, let's name it uh, jump scare GUI uh, Put a frame in it. Uh, border size pixel 100, 0, 0, 0, and 0, 0, 0, 0. 0 0.5, 0, 0, 0.5, 0, 0, 0. Uh, oops, 0, 0.5, 0, 0.5, 0, 0.5, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. And we're gonna scale it by 1, 0, 1, 0. And now put your image label in it, and you're gonna see this Jeff, Jeff, Jeffrey something face. So, uh, so you know you did it correctly. I'm gonna put it a little bit more in the um, in the middle because it doesn't look in the middle. This should be good. Insert a script in it and type while true do script dot parent dot rotation is equal to twenty five weight zero comma zero twenty five script dot parent rotation is equal to minus twenty five weight zero point twenty five. Okay, so now that you've done that, you can actually click on here so your GUI goes away, but it's gonna stay. Insert a local script in your jump scare GUI and type game of replicated storage dot uh, jump scare event uh, on client event colon connect function. And we're gonna do local PG is game dot player dot local player dot, uh, dot player GUI. Uh, and we're gonna do PG dot jump scare GUI dot frame dot visible is equal to true. Wait, so uh, 7.5 pg dot jump scare gui dot frame dot visible is equals to false, so it's gonna like put it false. Um, go in your jump scare part and type um, uh, a game dot workspace dot sound like your your sound colon play. Uh, game dot workspace dot uh, sound dot volume is equals to ten. I'm gonna put it well. I'm gonna put it five because uh, my audio is like really up and I don't want you to like feel annoyed. Uh, so what we're gonna do is uh, I'm gonna put my audio on and uh, this should work. Alrighty, let's test it. Uh, I'm gonna anchor everything. Yep, already anchored. Okay, gonna click on play here. We're gonna. Test this thing out. And Roblox decided to break on me. Okay, there we go. 
Uh, no errors. Um, if we go walk, we're gonna get the GUI. <laughs> And it's gonna spin like wee oo wee oo wee oo wee oo. What we also can do, so you know this was your thing. You can also do 15 and 15, but you can also do it like very, very fast. Let's test this one out. Uh, I'm gonna reduce the volume for you guys because uh, it was a bit loud. Okay, play here. Alrighty, we're here again. I'm gonna find my part so I can know where I'm going to jump scare you guys. Over here, we're gonna jump scare you and we'll go boom. And you can see. It hurt the scream and you got the, the, the frame. So this is your jump scare. Um, you can also make it like really, really intense, but people have epilepsy maybe, epilepsy. So they get like really scared and maybe I have problems for cure. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace out. Goodbye. <laughs>